Hi everybody, this is Rob from Shotgun Software and I'm going to demo our new Hero Engine for you. Over here in Shotgun I've got a project that I just created and put a couple of images on the overview page and I've got a new command over here that's launch hero. Click that and it's going to launch hero in a shotgun aware environment. And our goal here is to take a final cut XML that a client gave me in order to link up all of the media and go from zero to comp as fast as we can. I'm going to go ahead and just clean up the audio over here. Take a look at what our sequence looks like. All right, not too bad. Let's go ahead and give the sequence a nice thumbnail so everybody can see what it's supposed to look like and rename our shots to our studio convention. Our sequence itself is going to be sequence 100. All right, basic setup is done and I want to go ahead and save this as the first version of my file. Over here we've got a new addition on our menu for work file management. So I'm just going to go ahead and do a shotgun save as. It knows exactly where I want to put the file and follows the standard naming convention. So let's go ahead and save that. And now I want to do a little bit of review on these shots and only launch a couple of them. So let's say these first four are ready to go. I'm going to go ahead and give them a ready to start tag and the rest of these I want to hold off on. They are not quite set yet. In addition to that, let's say there's a bunch of green screen work over here. I want to go ahead and use a different set of tasks in order to process this task and I'm going to use our green marker in order to highlight that. Alright, we've got everything tagged up. I'm going to go ahead and just save a new version of this version 1, we're going to be on version 2. Go ahead and save that. And now I want to just get all of this information into Shotgun. Now before there is some pretty tedious shot creation, cut information, updating, thumbnail loading, all of that that you would have to do in Shotgun. All of that is replaced by this new processor that we've got over here that is based on the built-in hero shot processor. Um, and includes all of the functionality of that with the shotgun functionality layered on top of it. First thing you'll see is up top we've got this new GUI over here that lets you take all of the tags that we've just been using and map them to different things in shotgun. And it's all that I used the green tag and I can map that to be a different task template. So I'm going to say that that's a comp task template and the rest I'm just going to leave in their defaults. Over here we've got our shot structure. Now this just shows the hero portions of the shot structure. When we create the shots we're going to use the pipeline toolkit standard shot creation. In addition, um, for the plates you can see there's a shotgun transcode images step over here which is based on the transcode images but has a follow-up step where it takes the output of that step and will register it in shotgun as a version in a screening room compatible way. So let's go ahead and set up my handles. Let's say I only want 10 frame handles. I want to start on frame 101. All of that looks good. Let's go ahead and export. Choose my project root. And here we are. Now we're going to cut out a little bit in order to let this finish processing and come back when it's done. All right. Our export has finished and let's see what this looks like. You can see over here in Shotgun in the project update stream I've got all of the different versions for the plates that we've created and over here in the media browser you can kind of see the small thumbnails of them also. Let's jump over and look at our shots. Here we go. And you can see the status came in from our tags and if I jump over to shot 10 you can see that we've got our tasks already set up for comp. We've got our plate, they're ready to work. Let's go ahead and play that back. And we're going to want to give a little bit of direction as to what's going on in this shot. All right, all looks good. Let's just say 
uh, bleachers here. Go ahead and create that note. All right. And now let's go ahead and start comping. Jump over to the task. Let's show our shot. Right over there, we've got our nuke script. Let's go ahead and start comping. Right. Take a look. There we go. And we're ready. And that's an overview of the Hero Engine, which is released and ready for you to use. As always, we look forward to hearing what you think and getting everything working just right for you. Thanks a lot.